If you guys would like cheap and reliable MT, head over to NBAMTCoin.com. Use code BIO2K for 5% off your final order. What is going on, guys? It is your boy BIO2K, and today I'm bringing you guys a squad builder with basically the most, like, annoying cards that got put into the game this year the full base 11 squad builder obviously you guys could tell that this this lineup's about to be some cheese bro honestly there's some cards in here there's one card in here that really doesn't fit anymore and that is turkaloo turkaloo doesn't have base 11 anymore but i'm not going to make a base 11 squad builder without the biggest cheese ball from the beginning of the year so he's obviously making the squad but in the starting lineup we do have this gilbert arenas and the back court with him we do have the danny granger obviously and in the front court we have karolinko jameson and cowens cowens is very small for being like our center which kind of sucks actually how tall is he he's six nine and pettit is oops um hold on and pettit is how tall pettit is going to be six nine as well so i'm actually going to just start pettit because why not we might as well just do that have you know like that full opal starting lineup off the bench, though, we are going to have to be a little bit cheesy. I mean, we're going to have to run James Worthy at the point guard position. Um, we do have Turk Lou, like I said. We got Tom and we got Kiki. I'll actually switch switch it up like this. Maybe that'll help it out a little bit. Maybe a little bit less cheesy. And then we have Cowens, like I said. Amir Johnson and Frank Jackson actually both have base 11 as well. Um, so that's why they're out here. And then we have Isaac Bongo just to fill in that like final spot. I literally was asking, I asked two different streamers. I asked the OG Bio group chat. Like, I don't know who else to put here. I was going to put Big Z because I know a lot of people said that his like is kind of like base 11. Um, I was going to put Yao Ming, same thing, sort of thing with his jumper. I was going to put Melo there because Melo's jump shot is pretty close. Um, but I'm just going to leave it as Isaac Bongo for now because I'm pretty sure we'll be okay with the 10 other guys that we got going on out here. So hopefully this squad can go pretty good here. It doesn't even matter if we go up against somebody off balling because base 11 is the counter to that. So uh, yeah, this is the squad. I hope you guys do enjoy. 11 likes is the goal. Pretty sure you guys can figure out why. And uh, yeah, let's hop right into it. Guys, let's see who our opponent is going to have. He's going to have Nash, Dwayne Wade, Michael Finley, Amari Stoudemire, and Shaq. So he doesn't have that good of a team, which is pretty good. And he's using a point guard, which I was really nervous about because I actually wanted to be able to use... Um, I actually wanted to be able to use the... Um, what was I saying? I wanted to actually be able to use a Gilbert Arena. So that's nice to see here. This will be a nice little cheesy squad off the bench. Unfortunately, that's just what we're going to have to go with. I think, like, everybody off the bench is, like, 6'8 or 6'9. So, I really hate the cheese like that, but I got to do it this game. All right. So, Pettit on Shaq will be the only, like, real mismatch that we got going on here. And we win tip off. You got to love to see it. All right. So, he is going to be off balling. Or maybe not. I don't know. No, he definitely is. All right. That's fine by me. Like I said, if he's going to off ball, we can just seriously just L2 cheese him all game. And we will be getting these wide open threes all game. That was good defense, though, to start this game off from him. Won't even lie. Let's go. Play some good defense right back. Let's go, Granger. There we go. Nice little green bean. Finally getting a bucket to drop after starting this game off like 0 for 6 or something like that. I'll gladly take that. Let's play some good defense here, though. Get that lead right back, you know. Okay, like, oh, I'm just going to uh, make sure you don't rotate in there, my guy. Granger, what are you doing? Like, literally, what are you doing? We, we had that, my guy. Trust me. We were okay. You didn't have to step up. I don't know what you're doing out here, but we, you didn't have to step up. It's all right, buddy. Let's go play some good defense again. Let's go. Good block. I, I wasn't sure if that was going to be a block or what happened there. The good thing about this team, too, is, like, everybody is, like, since they can all shoot as well, most of their ball control uh, ratings are pretty high as well. So, everybody should be able to dribble out here. Um, that's the only problem. We were going to get killed on the glass, bro. That's good defense. Unfortunately, still resulting in a good dunk. Um, I think that's actually a duo between Stoudemire and Nash. So, that's pretty cool. There we go. Granger, good green bean. Let's go. Arenas, wide open. Easy shot. Dude, I for real cannot score this game. I'm shooting freaking two of eight to start this game off. Like, I don't understand. Like, I know base 11 is not the most consistent thing in this game, but like, my God, bro, you got to let me knock them down if they're open. Like, literally, I'm like I said, I'm two for eight. I think maybe two of them said lightly. I mean, like, come on now. We should be able to knock these down. I don't understand what the issue is here. The fact that we're only down two, though, is pretty amazing. Let's go. Easy, wide open three in the corner. Thank you. I just want to take a look at this starting quarter here. Like, we're literally 3 of 11, 3 of 10 from 3 on all wide open looks except for 2. And we have 4 turnovers already based off of my guys just dropping the ball. I don't know what kind of start that this game 2K was having, but hopefully we can turn it around right here. I'm not going to sit here and complain about it, you know. We're just going to clutch up, turn it right around. That's good defense. He's going to cash it home, of course, you know. When I'm in his face, it doesn't matter, but it's all good. 
Let's go, Granger. Wide open threes. Give me that right back. Come on. There we go. Go, Jameson. Wide open in the corner. There we go. Cashing him another three. I think I might do a threes only challenge here. Like, honestly, it's going pretty good so far now that we're actually knocking out threes. Like, we're staying in this game based off of just threes anyway. So, I think I might do that just to kind of add another twist to it. Let's go, Pettit. Wide open. I'll take that. There we go. Cashing home right through the net. Like I said, Pettit has actually been one of the more, like, consistent base 11 players for me. So, hopefully that can, uh, you know, translate or, you know. I, you know, I don't even know what word I'm trying to think. Good block right there from Granger. You guys probably know what word I'm trying to say. And I know somebody's going to be like, bio, I think this is the word you're looking for. And I'm going to be like, yeah, you're right. Yo, my man Pettit is a beast, bro. Six rebounds already. And he's playing some really solid defense down, down low. But like I said, he's been one of the more consistent ones for me. I'm actually going to uh, sub some of these guys in here. We're going to definitely get Worthy going on, see what he could do. Let's get some Kiki action going on here. Because so far, these starters definitely not proven too great. Um, oh, I saw that coming all day. Let's go. Good defense. Stay with him. We're probably going to get bodied in the post like all game. Yeah, I'm not even surprised. None of these guys can really play like the post. Now, Worthy has been my favorite base 11 player. So I'm kind of hoping that, you know, his, uh, you know, his ability to score the ball kind of will translate to what I need to see from him today. Okay. You're just going to leave my man Tom wide open. Like I'm down for that too, bro. My man Tom can splash home those threes. I might actually need to run the quick 21, like, or not quick 21. I might need to run the Warriors freelance, like, all game just to get these wide open threes. Because now it's at a point where he's just sitting here off balling me and whatnot. So I might have to do that. Kiki wide open, though. Give me that. There we go. We're literally only knocking down threes so far. So hopefully, like I said, I can continue doing this challenge. The only thing that will really break it is if he just sits here and off balls me because then I really don't have another choice. There you go. That's a lightly, but that still should be cash. I was going to say, that's a good shot right there. We just got to knock down these open shots, like as simple as that. Like we're 9 of 20, we're shooting a really bad, I mean 45% really isn't that bad, but in 2K, like that's really bad. That's a good closeout right there. Okay. You know, it doesn't even surprise me that nobody could grab that. <laughs> Go Kiki wide open again. Give me that. Oh my lord, bro. I'm going to freaking lose my mind. Let's go, Worthy, wide open. Thank you. Finally knocking down that three again. We got 10 threes so far this game. You know, we can. it's pretty easy to tell how many threes we got. We just got to knock them down, man. Like I said, they're all on wide open looks. So we just got to keep going. The bench is definitely playing a little bit better, though, than the starters did. Okay, can somebody grab a rebound? That will be... <laughs> <laughs> and I okay all these wide open shots that I'm breaking bro, but he can hit that gotcha Granger wide open. Thank you Let's go Granger back to back. Let's go baby heat up. That's what I'm talking about We need to keep going though. I want to see Granger light up the floor Obviously you guys know he's my favorite one. He's not the most consistent one, but he definitely is my favorite one Let's go good steal right there kick it up to Granger again Step the back. I know it's deep but green beating again. Who says that three-point challenge is dead? We're still out here, bro. My man Granger's lighting it up from the floor. Let's go. Clamp up. That's what I'm talking about. You see, now we're getting hyped. That's what we needed to do, bro. Now we just needed to get hyped, all right? I'm just saying. We were, we were struggling out here. The base 11 was not working. We were struggling, bro. Now I just need to, I was going to say, just give me that real quick. That, this will just top it off real quick. Yeah, you go ahead and foul me, bro. You go ahead. Foul me all you want, bro, because we smoke in this game. You guys keep asking me to make a 2K20 wish list, and like literally the main thing I want to just have next year is seriously to get rid of this off balling crap that like people can seriously just stand there and the computer will strip for them, like all that sort of stuff. Like they really need to do something about this. It's getting ridiculous, bro. Like I cannot play this game when somebody's just sitting in the corner and you got guys like Kawhi, Stockton, Arenas, like even Kevin Love just stripping literally every person. The minute I like don't touch the ball or the minute I don't like protect dribble or whatever, I just get stripped. So they seriously need to do something about that. Like this game is becoming so unplayable with shit like that. Granger wide open. Let's go. Good shot. Jameson wide open. There we go. I'll take that. It's a good pass from Arenas right there. We just got to keep knocking on these threes. Like we're doing fine. Oh my god, okay. Somebody's got to get back on defense, though. That's the whole point of a press. You know, there's at least one person back. So hopefully, you know, that can stop real quick. Pet it. Good pump fake. All right, step that back. Wide open. I'll take that. Good shot. There we go. Come on. Arenas wide open. I need that. There we go. Finally knocking down some consistent threes. This is all we've needed to do all game long. Is just finally start knocking these down. Because like I said, I knew that was going to happen. That is not a foul. Literally, I didn't even touch him. I just swiped in the air. But 
Yeah, like, this is all we've needed to do all game, bro, is just knock down these consistent threes. Like, that's all I wanted to see, fam. We're finally knocking them down. I'm starting to blow our opponent out a little bit here. We still have only made three so far, so I'm still keeping the three-point challenge alive. I mean, the off-balling was getting annoying. But, you know, we clutched up. My man, uh, my man Granger definitely kind of saved us a little bit. It's okay. Let's go, Jameson. Wide open. I'll take that. Good shot. There we go. Attack that off ball. That's how you got to make it here. That's how we got to win, you know? Just keep attacking that off ball. I put Worthy in at point guard because if he's going to sit here and freaking off ball me all game, I'm going to just start cheesing with Worthy a little bit. Good closeout right there. I was going to say, we got to snag that board, though. We're just going to get out rebounded, I feel like, all game. Like, it's just going to have to be something that we live with. Let's go. Good rebound, Worthy. Kick that the Granger. Okay. You know? There we go. Worthy. Wide open. I'll take that. You gotta knock that down, fam. Let's go, Cowan's good. Green being on that three-point line, I like that. We just ran the Warriors freelance backwards. I've never actually had it where the point guard set a screen for the center, but I'll take it. I don't even know if that was like what was supposed to happen, but like I said, it worked out in my favor. We ended up getting a nice wide open three from it. Let's go play some good defense again. Clutch up. Let's go, good closeout. Turkaloo was right there. Imagine freaking, like like I said, I know we're going to get out rebounded, but imagine letting Stockton grab the rebound, dude. Like, really? That's what we're doing. Kiki, my man, push up this floor, buddy. Let's go, D or not Dave. What? Let's go, Tom. You know, the other white guy name. It's all good, though. Let's go, good three. I mean, that, those are some pretty white names, I'm just saying. You know, it, it definitely makes sense how I can confuse those, but it's okay. Let's go, play some good defense here. No more giving up easy buckets. I'm kind of tired of... This right here, the freaking random rotations of switches and stuff that we just decided to be doing as a team. All right, he's... Oh, my God, bro. Like, literally, there's no defense that you need to play in this game. It's literally just run up and click square, and they will give you the steal like nine times out of ten. It's so stupid, man. Ah, oh, God. Kiki, wide open. Give me that. Let's go. One thing I noticed about this kid that I'm playing is, like, if he doesn't get one of those rotations where my guys rotate from the corner, he doesn't score. So as long as my team can seriously not rotate, we should be fine. I actually went into the settings menu, and I turned off, you know, like the uh, no help thing from the corners. So hopefully we can stop helping and probably just shut this kid down the rest of the game. But we have to really rely on the no rotation thing because it's kind of getting annoying. we got to be able to snag those rebounds here. Let's go, Carolyn. Go wide open, baby. I need that. Good shot. That's a clutch shot right there, giving us that five-point lead. We've only made three so far. It's kind of clutch, but we're doing what we can. Here. We've made 22 threes. We just got to keep it going. Good defense. I'm Okay. No, it's fine. It's fine. Just let it go. Just let it go. It's all good. I know I've been missing wide open all game. I, I, know, I don't got to tell myself. I'm already well aware. You know what I'm saying? I already know what's been going on, so it's, it's, it's good, bro. It's all good. We just got to keep it going, kind of rely on some of these cheesy little animations here. Oh, my God. Carolyn, go. Go back. Wide open. Give me that, please. Let's go. That's such a clutch three, bro. I, I'm not. I'm doing the three-point only challenge, bro. I told you. I'm not going to cave in just to lose this game or just to win this game. That is the way to clutch up, though. Carolingo getting wide open. You just got to know the animations in this game. That's all it is. We're right there. That's a red contest. Thank you. Obviously, if he sends me to the free throw line, like, I'm going to hit the free throws. We don't even need it, though. Tom, you know, it, it's just fitting to end the challenge by missing a wide open three. It really is. All right, honestly, that challenge could have went a lot better. However, Granger did lead the way for us. So everybody else did, like, pretty much had, like, a balance of scoring throughout the whole team. I mean, I didn't even shoot with Turkle. Everybody else I did shoot with. Um, but yeah, I just, I, I can't believe this, bro. I think we took one shot that wasn't a three. I was going to say, that was one shot that wasn't a three, and it was in the first quarter. Um, and it was, like, because I stepped over the line on accident as I shot it. So I'm glad it didn't even go in. But you guys can see, like, 38%. 42 percent and then like we finally started knocking out our shots but like the beginning of this game bro we were shooting really poorly like all wide open looks too that was like the probably the most frustrating part 40 percent and a half is really bad especially when you're shooting wide open looks like i probably took like two smothered i would say this whole game or two heavilies i mean and it was just because he was off balling but either way we did pick up the win though, which is pretty clutch. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy. Be sure to smash that like button for your boy. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next video. If you guys don't follow me on Twitch and on Twitter, be sure to go do so. We've been streaming Madden every day. It's actually been a lot of fun. But yeah, I'm going to be streaming 2K again. 
um, hopefully soon, especially if there's a new player of the month. So be sure to go check that out. And on top of that, obviously, like I said, go follow me on Twitter to stay up to date with all these videos and stuff like that. Because sometimes noties don't come out. So if you guys, you know, do enjoy the videos and whatnot, be sure to go follow me on Twitter. And uh, yeah, with that being said, I will see you in the next video.